Hey there! We are here at the Wisconsin Fishing Expo, um, actually at the Wisconsin Outdoor News booth. Um, so this is a really cool um, place to get information. Tell us about it. It is so cool. It's the best informational spot to get it. Well, let's we start over. This is our oh, we're live! We're live! Oh, we're live? <laughs> well, holy crap, we're live! So I messed up. So. Alright, well, no, it's a... <laughs> Kristen is, Kristen, you can stop laughing there. <laughs> let me help Dean out. <laughs> oh, no, I'm good. Let me get back on. Oh, okay. Let me get, let me get back on the horse. Can I get back on the horse? Yeah. All right, yeah, I'm absolutely. Back on the horse. Well, it, really, I think it is. There's a, it's the best spot to get news about the outdoors in Wisconsin. It'd be hunting, fishing, trapping, but not just that. If you wanted to do, uh, you know, we cover public land management, resource management issues. We get into the legislature and find out what rules might be coming down the pike for hunters, fishermen, trappers. We'll go to the Conservation Congress meetings in the spring, the second Monday of April, which is coming up, second Monday of April every year, go to Conservation Congress meetings in your county. And, uh, you know, we just, everybody who works here hunts, fishes, and traps, so we're all about it. We get the stuff in the paper, let people know what's going on. But we have fun things in there, too. We have uh, features about you know, who's doing what in the state, you know, uh, older guys, older gals who've been hunting most of their life, a little story uh, about what they've been up to all their lives, how they got their families into it, that kind of thing. Uh, so yeah, we, you know, I, I, well, I, you know, I can't even tell you the breadth of what we do, but it's, you know, over the course of a year, we cover a lot of ground. Well, and even just flipping through this specific issue, um, you know, there's a lot of really great stuff. An article about eating fish. There's an article about the sturgeon spearing that just happened on Winnebago. There is a section about letters, questions, and thoughts that people have that they want to send in. Um, you know, there was a quick section about electronics, what is right for you at the right cost. And these are all different articles that can, you know, relate to any type of angler. But even more than that, you know, we have lake profiles. So whole you know ideas of where to fish how to fish what the lake is like what you might be catching um and certainly the location of where it is so it's also a way to help you explore the state and i live in Manaqua, so i'm in vilas county almost on the vilas oneida county line this lake is an iron county it's only 35 ish 40 ish miles from where i'm at i hadn't fished this one yet but i'm gonna this summer i mean it's it, uh, i went and talked to the call the fish biologist from iron county we chatted for 20 minutes, uh, talking about what's all in there. And I mean, you look at this if you got a windy day and you're fishing on the Turtle Flambeau Float and you're getting blown all over the place, to know that you got long length there. And if it's a west wind, look, you can get right in there and you can cast back and forth for muskies and probably have a peaceful day. Whereas if you're on big water, you're going to get bounced around. So, yeah, so I'm gonna, this, is, this one's going to be on my list for the summer. Um, so that's really awesome. Aside from all the tips and tricks and cool information inside, you know, you have a whole adventure coming. And that's a really cool thing to get just out of one um, one magazine, one newspaper. Um, so for people who are here today, they can come and they can check out these newspapers. Um, I bet they would even let you read one here if you wanted to. I, I would even read it to them if they wanted to. <laughs> I could read it to them. Uh, and, but yeah, it, it, we do 26 issues a year. So it's not a weekly, it's not a monthly. Uh, it's, and a lot of people aren't used to that, but we do it every other week. You get it in your mailbox, uh, we do 26 a year, so we can kind of keep up with the issues as they're evolving. Um, and always fairly current information, so you're not reading what happened a month ago. Sometimes I even project what I think is going to happen. That usually never comes to pass, I'm almost always wrong, but people just seem to like speculation, so I'll throw it out there. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, 26 issues, $29 a year, you sign up here at the show. You get a free hat or a free calendar, and uh, show up, cool. it'll start showing up in your mailbox in about three weeks. For people who cannot be at the show, how do they get a hold of this? Well, then we just call the 800 number down here on the bottom. Call that number, and uh, friendly people on the other end will answer your call, say how you doing, and let's get sign you, you up. up. Yeah. Awesome. Check it out.